What's going on guys? So I am out here at the cargo trailer. Got this product called Bow Shield T9. It's a rust and corrosion protection product, waterproof lubrication. This is apparently designed by the Boeing company. So this is supposed to be something you can spray on pretty much any type of metal component to protect it from rust or corrosion. I'm gonna spray this on some of the suspension components of the cargo trailer, see how it works. So I have no idea how this product's actually gonna work in the long run. I'm gonna test it out, see how it works. Again, they sent this to me, just one bottle so I can see how it works. Shake it up real well. And I'm going to hit the Dexter Easy Flex system here, just right around these areas where it tends to rust. Another good area would be right around here in the coupler. The coupler tends to be one of those areas that gets kind of hard to work with. I'll also put a little bit on this little handle right here because last time it rusted up really bad on the other worn winch that I had. So maybe that'll protect it a little bit. And then some more back here on this shackle hanger. There we go, we'll see how this stuff works. Again, I have no experience with this product. I've used other products that are designed for rust and corrosion protection. Some work pretty well. Most of them actually work pretty well, so I'd be interested to see if this one works any better than those. But I'm gonna apply it to some other areas, see how it works overall, and I will give you all an update in a few weeks, maybe a couple of months, just to see how this has held up over time. Anyways, guys, enjoy the video. All right guys, so I just wanted to share with you a repair I need to do. Basically a mishap that happened a while back when the seven-way connector got caught up in a turn when, uh, when it ran out of slack and it got caught on part of the pin box. Anyways, it snagged this factory fifth wheel connection here on the side, which is the seven-way adapter that comes on the side of trucks equipped with the fifth wheel gooseneck prep package and it ripped this out. But fortunately, because it ripped this bottom part out, it was able to disengage before it caused more damage to this entire structure. So I went ahead and ordered the replacement part from eTrailer.com. The cool thing about eTrailer is they carry a bunch of cool stuff like this, even the factory replacement plug. So if you've ever damaged yours, if it's gotten too dirty, or if you've bent a prong or something like that, eTrailer actually carries these in stock. So here's the replacement that'll be going in. Like I said, it is identical to the factory plug. And on the back of it, you simply take the harness coming from the truck, plug it right into the back of this, put this back in the place of the factory location, tighten it, and you're good to go. All you're gonna need to do is remove the seven millimeter screws that hold it in. Then you're gonna disconnect it right here by pressing that in. All right, so here is the plug I'm removing. You can definitely see where it cracked. Right along the edge here, all the way around the screws here and here and here. And this whole plug broke loose. So I'm gonna be replacing it with the one I got from eTrailer. As you can see, it is identical in every way, except it is not damaged. It should just be plug and play. I'll screw it back in and we'll be good to go. And just to show you the model number difference, this is the e-trailer aftermarket one. It is the PA66-GF30 and the OEM one is the PA6-6FM40. So that's really the only difference between the two. Okay, I'm simply gonna kind of line up that tab right there, pop it in place. It's locked in. Nice and tight. Put it back where it goes.
There we go. All repaired. $12 part, and you're all good and repaired. Anyways, guys, if this is something that's happened to you and you need to get the replacement plug, again, e-trailer carries these for all the different manufacturers. So whether you have a Ram, a GM, or a Ford, if you need this side plug, they have it. If you want to incorporate it into your truck, they also carry that as well. So you can add the side connection for your trailer, fifth wheel, whatever you have, the seven-way plug here to the side of your truck if you plan on adding it. Guys, I will put a link in the description to this video of where you can get this. And if you're interested in it, please check them out. Anyways, guys, if you haven't had a chance, please take a moment, subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up, and we'll talk to you again very soon.